here. The Elite is built with the Columbus Thron tube set. So uh, it's a really nice lightweight steel tubing. Has investment cast dropouts. So you notice the nice details here, like the little 86, which represents the year of our founding. It also has uh, the dropouts down here are uh, 142 by 12 through axle with nailed innovative um, quick release through axle system. I'll show you on the front so you okay. have a better uh, view on how it works. Um, it's fully equipped for adventure touring with you know rack and fender mounts, dual eyelet dropouts, triple bottle cages, low rider fork mount. Um, we built the bike with a taller head tube. Excuse me, so you can run a, uh, a shorter, uh, shorter stack of spacers. Also, the handlebars are a nice shallow drop, so you can actually use this hand position more often than you would in a traditional drop bar. So multiple hand positions for long days in the saddle yeah. with a 20 degree sweep, so a little bit more confidence when you're riding off road. Um, I'll show you that uh, the nailed quick release system here. Maybe that's the best way to get it. Yeah. So um, this is a company called Nailed, N-A-I-L-D, and this is called their 9312 uh, quick release. So it's a through axle, but it uh, it's quicker to use than a quick release. So press in this little red tab here, move it from nine o'clock to three o'clock to twelve o'clock, hence the name, and then it slides right out. Um, oh, that's sick. It's pretty cool. It has a little uh, keyway here, so unless you're in the keyway, you know you can't throw the lever. So there's no accidental engagement. So put it in the keyway. Again, you can't engage it until you actually close the lever. So boom, and boom. Nice. So in reality, to watch it work at normal speed would be. So it's super quick. Yeah, I guess once you get the uh, the hand motion down, it's pretty simple. Yeah. Pretty simple. Um, there's no, pr no, no preload adjustment on the other side. It's factory set. You can adjust it if it comes out of spec somewhere on down the line, but that really doesn't happen. Okay. The bike is equipped with um, WTB's I-25 rims with a 25 millimeter inner spacing, uh, which is up from the I-23s we ran last year, and also WTB's Riddler 45C tires, again, up from the 40C uh, Schwalbas that we had last year. Uh, one more change from last year was uh, we went to a 38 tooth chain ring uh, from a 40, which is um, used in conjunction with the 10 to 42 tooth chain uh, cassette and back. So you've got you know mountain bike style gearing that's you know well suited for fully loaded days, long days in the saddle, yeah. um, and riding on dirt.